We've driven all the way to the bottom of the Baja Peninsula and we're just outside Cabo San Lucas. If you missed our last episode, we hit a pretty big roadblock when we arrived. But thankfully, we're on the road to recovery. And after spending almost an entire month parked at this beach, we finally packed up our van, got back on the road, and made our way to the East Cape. The destination will be on the right. We've been laying low at this beautiful remote beach for almost a week. I'm finally back on my feet and we're ready to return to Cabo and get back to exploring. We're at La Fortuna. This is another beautiful beach where you can camp for free. There's no amenities, so you gotta bring your own situation with your camper van, which is why the van is so handy. It's time for us to leave this beach and we are gonna head back to the Cabo area. Bye bye beach. Come to Chileno Beach. This is a beach that is supposed to be good for swimming, so we're thinking it will be a good spot for me to go get a little bit of exercise and strengthen my hip doing some swimming, and we can use the showers. There you go. Nice little spot. Ooh. How was it? Yeah, it's fish like this big. Oh, cool. We went for a little swim. Saw some fishes. Now we're heading back to the van. Saw some whales as well. So we're going to leave this beach and then head to another beach, Santa Maria, where we're hoping that we can park in the parking lot. And then in the morning, we can go to that beach before it gets really busy, because tomorrow is Saturday. Where are we going? Oh, there's a bunch of vans. Yeah. Okay. This looks like a cool little spot to call home for the night. Let's find somewhere relatively flat. Yeah. Good morning. So we slept in the parking lot last night. We had a good sleep. Now we're up fairly early, had our breakfast, took Finley for a walk. Now we're going to mosey on down to the beach and do a little bit of swimming. This beach is known for being quite busy and tour buses showing up. So it's about nine o'clock. So we're going to head down now and hopefully beat the crowds. Are you going to be okay walking this? I am. This one really wasn't that far. I thought it'd be farther. This beach is beautiful. So there's a resort next to this beach right behind me. And it's this beautiful little secluded inlet, but you can get access to the beach as well. So we're just hanging out on the beach. So the best spots to snorkel are by the rocks. Um, to the left, you have to watch out for the waves hitting you. The right's calmer and it'll get really busy in the afternoon with tours and in the middle is a sandbar. So we're going to take turns circling and hanging out on the beach. How was it? Good, this one was long. Yeah? I'm quite big too. <laughs> I had to keep defogging, letting water into these to defog them. But 
There's a lot of like big fish over there, like medium sized fish over there. Cool. Like easily this big and schools it. You would really like it. I came back so you could try. Oh, Dad, you want to on your fish? Oh, start time was really fun until the jellyfish came and <laughs> got me on the back. <laughs> yeah, there's lots of skills of fish. And the weather, water was really clear as well. And the tour boats are here. It's starting to get hot, so we're going to head back now. And it's getting crowded. Lots of lots of tour boats. Today we are going in to explore downtown Cabo San Lucas. We got a parking spot right next to the harbor. It was 15 pesos an hour and it's in a great location. So we're just gonna head to the harbor now. So apparently you can do tours to the arch for $30 for two people. Just bad. It's only an hour, but good tour. So we just walked all the way around here and it's lined with lots of shops and restaurants and you can see all the fishing boats and it is very lively. After Finley. Yep. All right, so we're back at the van. We just explored downtown Cabo. Just at the end, our cruise ship docked and it got significantly busier. So we're going to head to one of the beaches that are just outside of Cabo, hang out there for the rest of the day, and we'll come back tomorrow morning and we're going to do the arch tour. Good morning, about to go hop on our tour boat to go see the arch. Okay, please be careful what you say, the captain copy, copy and couple men, okay? Thank you. Oh, it's wet. <laughs> Ready to go see the arch? Yeah. Water's very clear, there's lots of fish down there. <laughs> Here they come. Oh, look at the colorful ones. Yeah. Oh, there's a window over there. Oh, look at that. Oh. Cool. The famous art. How was your morning? You know, interesting. Interesting morning. <laughs> so there's two beaches. Behind me is Lover's Beach. And then this side is Divorce Beach. <laughs> Interesting rock formations. 
So we're just gonna hop back on the boat and head back to the harbor. Finley. Hi, Finley. Hi, bud. You look like we just caught you doing something, buddy. How are you doing? Let's go. Hey, guys. Oh, hey, guy. So we're back at the van. We're all done our tour. It was an experience. We got to the pier at 10 o'clock like we were supposed to, and I think the cat didn't show up so then we went on another boat uh, but the tour itself was a lot of fun you kind of got to roll with it in uh, when you're traveling in Mexico and this was one of those times but yeah and we saw Land's End and we saw the Cabo Arch it was fun